further than you are now. Huh? I want you to go on further here. We begin with breaking news right now. You are watching the moment a North St. Louis County pastor learned about an active shooter threat to the church building. Good evening. I'm Mike Bush. Police were called to Grace New Covenant Church Community Ministry Center just after noon today for reports of a shooting. No one was injured, but after learning about the shooting, the pastor ended the service asking members to leave. Our Robert Townsend joins us live outside the church. Robert, uh, what are you learning? Hey Mike, right now all is quiet outside this North St. Louis County Church, but again about five hours ago, gunshots rang out inside this sacred place. Take a look at the video. Investigators telling us around noon today a surveillance camera caught the armed man on video when he walked through the church's front door. Now police say minutes later the man fired shots at a security guard and then hopped in a car and sped off with his wife and two children. Police say the security guard fired back. They also tell us the two men know each other and are quote extended family members. About 40 people from brothers and sisters in Christ Fellowship Church were inside this building at the time. Now for the past year and a half, that congregation has rented the building from Grace New Covenant Church community. Thankfully, the good news, nobody was hurt when the gunshots rang out. A startled pastor, Ernest Howard, knew he had to do everything to keep his family and members safe. Uh, we, while we were getting ready to transition into another part of the service, we heard gunshots. And uh, all I could do was remember my training for active shooters because our church has been trained for that to make sure everybody shut the doors off, get down in the back, and then we tried to rectify the situation. During the incident itself, there were four gunshots fired, two from the suspect and two from the victim. Apparently, the, uh, when the suspect was running away, he fired a shot, and the, the victim, who works security for the church service, um, actually returned fire. But nobody was hit that we know of. Uh, the suspects were last seen heading eastbound on Chambers Road. And right now, police are still looking for that gunman. They're asking anyone with any information about the church shooting to call the Bell Fountain Neighbors Police Department. Live in North St. Louis County, Robert Townsend, five on your side.